James, fantastic to see you back from the start. Um, what did today mean after the last year? Yeah, I mean, it was a big step in like my progress and getting back. Obviously, it's been, what, 11 months since, and it's incidentally the same team that I um, got injured against. So it's a, it's a good one for me to get over, getting that first 90 minutes in, and I felt good. So hopefully I can keep pushing and progressing, and we'll see where we are. How hard have you worked since the injury last February? Yeah, it's been uh, non-stop. I mean, everyone close to me will know, all the boys at the training ground will know uh, what it takes to, to come back from an injury like that and to come back well. Um, it's been tough, but I've had good people around me so to help me through it. You had, what, 40 odd minutes in midweek, one half of under 23 football before that, and then you've, you've just played 90 minutes in the Premier League. How are you feeling now? Yeah, I feel, okay? yeah, 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 I feel fine to be fair. I mean, with the extended time out, I mean, this is what you're building up to play is 90 minutes and the, the physios and the sports scientists have obviously laid in different things for me so that when I come back, I'm available to play what they want me to. So it's good. And we saw from the start your, your marauding runs from right back. You ended up in a back three. Um, how do you assess the, the performance yourself and the team's performance against Brighton? Yeah, I felt, I felt good, to be honest, uh, for most of the game. Could have done better on the goal. I mean, it's probably just one of those things where you come back to play, getting your surroundings, but um, got to do a little bit better on that. But I can't be too harsh on myself. I've been out for a while and, uh, and it's, it's good to be back. And then just on the team performance, I thought we played well in the first half, started the second half well, and then just kind of sat back a bit too much um, for everyone's liking and maybe didn't have the, the confidence to, to play through them. But that's something we've got to look at during the next week and uh, work on important having conceded that you you didn't then concede again at least to, to come away away with a point from the match yeah i mean it's been a been a big talking point over the last few days obviously since spurs um but we feel like we're a team that doesn't take two steps backwards so we just keep on building and learn from our mistakes hopefully and and push on and from your point of view now for, for the rest of this season what what are your objectives i mean just to play as many games as possible, stay healthy, stay fit and help the team in whatever way I can. And it's all a matter of Nottingham Forest up next. Um, that's a big game and one I'm, I'm sure that you'd love to be involved in. Yeah, I mean, I mean, it's going to be incredible going there and, uh, and playing in that derby. I've heard a lot about it, so I hope it lives up to the hype.